All right, Smokey Rob here. We're at Campus 805. We're gonna go to Straight to AL. We heard that they've got some pretty good Asian ribs. You know, I'm all about the ribs, so we're gonna give it a try for the ribs. We might have a brew. Uh, see if they got any other interesting meats. So if you enjoy what you see here, like, subscribe, and if you know about any barbecue places that I might like to try, tell me about them in the comments. See you inside. I think there's a speakeasy behind these lockers. We're gonna find out. Oh, must be 21 to enter. Let's see what's in there. Okay, Smokey Rob here. We got the uh, pork belly tacos. I don't know if you can see that, but it's just the pork belly, which when you know when you buy like the family pack of ribs that will come with like the the, ring, the St. Louis cup, the rice brown, and the pork belly. And the pork belly is just so awesome because it's just like rib meat with no bone to fool with. And it's straight up rib meat. And then we also got the crispy Asian uh, ribs that have. So we're going to try both of these. First, we're going to try the uh, pork belly tacos. Put a little bit of lime on them. Minus the french fries. A little good bite of that pork belly. Wow, good and tender. Got a little bit of rub flavor to it. Don't taste a lot of smoke, but it it is a very good flavor to that meat. I don't know nothing about it, though. See, see the meat in there. And the pork belly. Just straight up rib meat with no bone. That's good. That's a good it's got a jalapeno flavor or something that's coming on now. A little bit of spice to it. And now we're going to try the, the, the Asian thing. Let's see if it'll pass the uh, Smoky Rob bite test. I'm going to bite it. It came off easily, almost a little bit too easily. It's a little bit on the done side, but still has a good meaty texture to it. Well, it's got a crispy kind of rub outside uh, Asian flavor to it. It's very Asian-y. It's still very good flavor to it. And it's uh, got a good texture to it. Let's try the bite on the other side. Again, it's coming off a little bit too much, so it's a little bit overcooked, but still it's very good. Still has a great taste and flavor to it. It's a different type of rib, but not a bad rib. I like it. It's um, that Asian flavor to it. It would be a good change of pace rib. I like it. So, enjoy it. Uh, no, this is the, the milk stout beer. It's actually going well with the, uh, the pork belly tacos. have quite a bit of jalapenos on them, and the heat's slowly coming on. But the milk stout is doing an excellent job cutting a little bit of the heat. It's a little bit different. It's not your typical barbecue flavor, but it's still very good for the pork belly tacos and uh, the sweet Asian spicy ribs. Also, it's not your typical barbecue. Still very good. Back to the beer. Okay, Smokey Rob, we just had a interesting barbecue lunch. It was a little bit different. We had the, uh, the pork belly tacos and we had the crispy Asian ribs which is barbecue, but it's a different kind of barbecue. So if you're into barbecue, but you want a little bit of different flavor of barbecue, I recommend coming here. And I recommend trying the beers too. They, uh, if you're into beers, they have a lot of different um, local brews that they make here to try from. The milk stout seemed to cut the jalapeno pretty good. I recommend it. So Smokey Rob's saying, stay smoking.